is Dane's Bar and Grill here in Peoria, and this morning I'm going to try the Great Dane Challenge. It's three meaty burgers made into one monster. So we're going to go in there and see if I can't take down this challenge. I've got 20 minutes to take down the Great Dane. This is Dan versus Food. When a burger comes along, you must eat it. Pounding hot wings in a thong, you must eat it. With good food, you can't go wrong, you must eat it. Now eat it with your mouth. Munch it up, swallow down, clean your plate, pound it in. It's Danvers Food now. Let's make a date to eat it. Eat it all. We're back here in the kitchen at Dane's, and uh, we're back here with Brian. Brian, can you explain to me what the Great Dane is? Yeah, it's three half pound burgers, uh, chosen between two triple stack grilled cheese sandwiches. You got nine pieces of bacon, six pieces of cheese, a pound of fries, and a half pound of coleslaw with a uh, side of a half pound of fries. Wow, so total weight of that, what, what would that dish be? Uh, I'd say about three and a half pounds. Three and a half pounds of food. Wow, okay, well, I'm looking forward to taking this challenge on, my right. friend. Dun, dun, dun. Wow, Brian. That is a masterpiece. You did not tell me it was that big, though. That is fantastic. That's fantastic. I am going to have a lot of fun eating this down. Have a good time. Enjoy. Uh, all right. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. This is Dan versus Food. I got 20 minutes to get this bad boy down, and I may get my face up here on this wall. So here we go. Wow, I'm getting a little full. This is by far the greatest sandwich that I've ever put in my mouth. But it is also the biggest sandwich I've ever had sitting in front of me. Ugh. I've been going here for about 15 minutes, I think. Um, I'm getting to the end of my rope. Ugh. All right. Ugh. All right. I'll tell you what. Brian, I'm tapping out. I'm done. I can't do any more, man. What are you talking about, man? You still got a few minutes left. No, I, I can't do any more. I've reached my limit. I'm about ready to explode right now. I've eaten so much. <laughs> I think that the Great Dane has won, and food won. Oh, time to pay up, my friend. Time to pay up? Time I, to pay up. But I didn't, I, I know I didn't finish, but I didn't bring my wallet with me today. Uh, oh, like I said, I mean, we got dishes you can do, floors, floors you can scrub, or something like that. Dishes Ooh, I can do, up. floors I can scrub. Floors you can scrub. I have delicate hands. Uh, Dan, why didn't you finish the Great Dane? Well, I, I couldn't finish the Great Dane because basically this was my first Dan versus food, and I'm still training. I'm still trying to get myself uh, worked up to where I could take a big challenge like that. Yeah, little girl. No, no, not a little girl. Little not. girl. Next. <laughs> Brian, how do you think Dan did on the challenge? I think Dan did fairly well. He got, you know, about halfway through it, did okay. Did okay. So Dan, how do you feel about the 15 year old girl that just about finished that challenge? Really? You're gonna bring up the 15 year old girl again? Everybody keeps bringing up the 15 year old girl that came in and tried this. All right, uh, why do I think that she can do a lot better than I did? Well, uh, like I said, this is my first Dan versus food and maybe she has a little girl versus food that she's been doing for a while. So maybe she's already good at it. 